am I? Johnny? Johnny fucking Powell. What are you doing here? And where the hell are we? You let stupid stuff get in your head, then it gets all jumbled and weird, and people think you're nuts! Come find me, Jay. Hello. Tony, Tony, what happened? Did you find the guys who hit us at the restaurant? Sometimes I can't tell the difference between a fruit and a vegetable. Jesus Christ, what is this place? I gotta get out of here. I like grapes. Ah, no, ah, ah, ah! Yeah. What the fuck was that? Jackie, over here! Jesus Christ, Jackie, we thought you was dead. What happened back there? I, uh... I handle things, like I always do. What the hell's going on, Tony? Hell if I know, boss. Look, we gotta get out of here. You go in your limo, and I'll go ride in the car with Vinny. He busted up a couple of ribs, but he's gonna be fine. The first time you use the darkness, it scares you. But once you've tasted it, you can't stop. That's all you think about. Like I said, it consumes you. Every second of every day for the last two fucking years, I kept myself in check. Gritted my teeth and kept it buried. Oh, now it's back. And I can feel what it's doing to me. So, uh, I guess setting you up with the twins didn't go so good, huh? Yeah, no shit. I'm glad you're all right, Vin. Now, can you tell me what the fuck just happened? I don't know. I saw some weird looking guy had a limp. It was crazy. Like, one minute he's there, the next minute the guy just fucking disappears. I don't know. I must have hit my head or something. Look, anyways. Jimmy says he's got a lead on the crew that hit us. Good. I'll find Jimmy. Tell him to meet me in my office. I'm gonna head upstairs. Yeah, sure. Whatever you need, Jackie. Thank Christ he got it back, you know? What do you mean? You heard the expression, mess with the bull and you get the horns? <laughs> well, mess with Jackie and you get those two things of his. I'll take those things over horns any day. I mean, how do you think he took over the whole family so fast in the first place? That fucking thing of his, that's how. Hey, Butch, Leo. Hey, boss. We was just talking about you. Glad you got your, uh, mojo back. Let's send a message to these fucks that think they can hit us. Hey, you got that right. We're ready whenever you need us, boss. I saw you again today, in the alley, down on the tracks. I still see you, 
everywhere I go. You torture yourself with her memory, Jackie. Jenny would never have wanted this. It scares me that you're so much like your father, Carlo. He could never let things go. Aunt Sarah, I'm fine. How many times I gotta tell you? You're a terrible liar, Jackie. Sometimes, sometimes I, I think I see her. And it's like, it's like she's not gone. But she is gone, Jackie. You buried Jenny years ago. I know, I know. Listen, Aunt Sarah, thanks for looking out for me, but I'm okay, all right? Just got a lot on my mind right now is all. Fine. You ever get the balls to actually talk about all this, come see me in my room. All right, fine. You want to bust my chops, then let's talk. What do you mean, like my father? I loved your father. Everyone loved Carlo. He just had that way about him, but before... Before we lost him, he couldn't let things go. He became obsessed, and that obsession consumed him, Jackie. I don't want to see the same thing happen to you. Obsessed with what? It... It's not important. Y you just have to let go, Jackie. You have to move on with your life. I am, Aunt Sarah. I am. You really are the worst liar I've ever met. And I grew up with thieves. So what then? I'm seeing ghosts? I don't believe in ghosts, Jackie. But I do believe in being haunted. You need to man up and let all of this go. You're right. How come you're always right? Comes with age, kiddo. I'll talk to you later, Aunt Sarah. You know where to find me. Hey, boss. So what's what? I want you to go find somebody for me. Johnny Powell. Lives down by the Queensboro Bridge. You find him and bring him back here. Johnny Powell? Ain't that the guy that used to help you out with that thing of yours? He was a weird fuck. Whatever happened to that guy anyway? It don't matter. I need him back. Go bring him by for a visit. And hey, you don't have to be nice to him. Whatever you say, boss. I'll have the new guys go get him. Oh, hey, uh, Jimmy's waiting for you in your office. He's got a lead on the guys who hit us tonight. Thanks, Finney. Anytime, boss. Let me know if you need anything else.
Jackie. Good to see you in one piece, kid. And Vinny says you got information for me. This thing at the restaurant. I just heard from Emilio Capizzi. A couple of hours later, someone torched our warehouse down at the docks, and Freddy tells me two of our boys got clipped outside of Gino's Deli tonight. Somebody's making a play. Whoever did this to us is dead. You hear me, Jimmy? There's the Jaggy Estacado I know. Vinny told me you got that thing of yours back tonight. It's about fucking time. All right, all right. Just tell me what you know already. A waiter recognized one of the guys who came into the restaurant tonight. Some guy named Swifty. Oh, Swifty. Yeah, I know that prick. He left as soon as I got there. Yeah, I never actually met him before, but I'm definitely looking forward to meeting him now. I had Vinny get some of the boys together. Let us know when you're ready to go and kick some righteous ass. Things ain't the way they was no more. Jackie, give me a shot when you're ready to go. Hey, Jackie. What say we go pay this asshole Swifty a visit? Let's go crack some skulls. Out of board, boss. Let's head down. Well, here we go. Time to go to work. Want to know something funny? When I was a kid, the dark used to scare the shit right out of me. I always felt like there was something out there. In the shadows. Just waiting. And Sarah always said I was a smart kid. She tried to tell me, Jackie, either you control your fears, or they'll control you. And I tried to control them, believe me. I tried. But every night, there I was. Hiding under the sheets, trying to convince myself that whatever was out there wasn't real. Thank God I outgrew that shit, huh? Hey, Jackie's here. Yo, Jackie. You wanna give me a hand here? Dag says I'm not supposed to lift anything heavy. Hey, Jackie. You ready to do your thing? Just point me in the right direction, Jimmy. Swifty was at the restaurant just before it all went down. He runs an executive poker game in a pool hall up around his corner. Follow me. This is Swifty's neighborhood, Jackie. We don't got a lot of friends around here. And those guys in there with Swifty? They ain't exactly the friendly types, either. Good. Because I ain't exactly in a friendly mood. Tell Vinny and the boys to seal off the exits. Nobody leaves here alive until I get some answers. That a boy, Jackie. Jackie, here he is. Oh, hey, hiya, Jackie. Those are some nice shoes. Are those Balutis? Kiss ass. Stop talking and show me what you can do.
took them all out. I can hear that. You are so alive. alive. You know, you know, you know, I said, what are we gonna do? He disappeared. Enter his knees, keep him out You swifty. You're not smart enough for a hit like this. Fuck you. You were weak and I made a play. Now I'm gonna finish the job. 
Let's see how you deal with this one, shithead! We're gonna need more than bullets to knock out that thing! No worries, Jackie! I'll find something for you! Hurry the fuck up! Here you go, Estacado! You stupid sack of shit!
Face, what took you so long? Jenny? Were you expecting some other girlfriend? Come sit with me for a minute. I'd give you a free beer, but you're not even legal until tomorrow. I must be losing my fucking mind. I asked Giancarlo if I could take your birthday off. He tried to give me a hard time, but I gave him the Bambi eyes, and he caved. He says he's even going to bake you a cake. I was thinking maybe you could come over to my new place, and we could watch a movie or something. Hello? Earth to Jackie? Are you okay? Jenny. Is this real? Yeah, you and me, young and in love. Face it, you lucked out. Oh, I love this song. Dance with me, Jackie. Come on, slugger. You can do this. I believe in you. I don't know what this is, and I don't fucking care. I think about you every day, Jenny. Every minute of every day. You're so sweet, Jackie. Did I ever tell you that? You act all tough, but deep down, you're all heart, you know? What happened to you was my fault, Jenny. Shh. Listen to the song. Listen to the words. Isn't it beautiful? I wish I could change things. I wish you were alive. It should be me who's dead, you know? Jackie, we're together now. That's all that matters. I still remember the first day I met you. All the other kids, they picked on me. But not you. You. You were my only friend. You saved me, and I let you die. Nuh-uh-uh. Giancarlo won't be back for an hour. Why don't you come back around here for a minute? Jenny? Damn it. It deceives you. Leave me alone! You are alone. Jackie. 
Murphy, you piece of shit! Don't leave us out here with him! Oh, oh, Jesus. Jesus fucking Christ, don't kill me! Swifty, I got all fucking night. It's too light. Step away from the night. And darkling light.
going nuts. I 
Better start talking. I think I think they're like some kind of secret club or something, you know? They gave they gave me an envelope with a whole load of cash in it. Their boss, their, their leader, whatever. I, I, I met him in a brothel, the, the Brimstone Club, alright? Look, I'm telling you, th these guys are some kind of Hey! What the fuck are you doing? Stop it, you miserable fucking friend. What the fuck did you do? I needed him! I needed answers! Was nothing. Once the darkness gets a hold of you, you start to lose control. You start to wonder what the fuck you're doing. Time slips away from you. And then, all of a sudden, it's like you're sitting in a theater, watching a movie of your own life. And you're up there on the big screen, big as life. You're a fucking movie star, and you're killing all the bad guys, tearing them limb from limb. And you feel good, you look good. Fuck, you are good. And then you realize something. Everyone else in the theater, they're screaming. Because they're watching a horror movie. And you're not the hero. You're the monster. Eddie and Frank are checking out the Brimstone right now. And the new guys found your buddy, Johnny Powell. Yeah, he didn't take to your invitation, so we put him in the back room so he could shit his pants for a while. Follow me. Can't wait to see him again. Yeah, it's me. This guy's a couple clowns short of a circus, Jackie. He wasn't living by the Queensboro Bridge. He was living under it, in a cardboard box. All right, come on. He's back here. Hey, Chief, how's the wife and kids? Hmm. Well, he's in a good mood. There you go. Knock yourself out. So let's say you live in a big house and you own some books. I mean, some other fuck nuts might live at the North Pole and they own a lawnmower, but that, that don't mean nothing. I can keep a secret. I can keep a secret. Just let me go and I won't breathe a word. Scout's honor. Johnny Powell. You look like shit. You were supposed to be the expert. I paid you good money to help me figure things out, and you repaid me by skipping out in the middle of the night. 
For what? Jackie, I did what I could to help you control the darkness. But being around you was becoming a problem for me. The darkness is so fucking seductive. I could hear it whispering to me whenever I was around you. It was starting to change me. Are you gonna kill me? Is that what this is all about? I let it out, Johnny. Now I don't know if I can control it. Let the darkness back out? Jesus Christ, Jackie, that thing is like a slow suicide. Then help me get it back under control. You don't control the darkness, Jackie. You cower in fucking fear of it, and you pray it goes away. The longer the darkness is active, the more it'll try to confuse you. <laughs> it'll try to trap you, make you see stuff that, that, that other people can't see. I need your help, so you're back on the payroll until I say you can go. Bunch of assholes just came after my entire operation. And whoever gave them this envelope is connected to the darkness somehow. I need you to figure out who they are and what they know about it. Okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, I, I, I'll do what I can. It's... It'll go a lot faster if you get one of your gorillas to untie me. Please? You can untie him now, Chief. But keep an eye on him for me, would you? Hmm. Oh, that guy really let himself go. I used to think he was pretty smart. Now he looks like something the cat threw up. Hey, hey. Frank and Eddie are back from the club. They're waiting for you with Jimmy in your office. All right. Thanks, Vin. Don't you listen to that voice in your head, Jackie. You fear the darkness like it was the devil himself. Everything it says is a lie. <laughs>